The one they use in the movies. That's the first time I saw you, and you were leading me up the stairs. They're on someone's car. Ah! Sunday after the party. The party was on Friday. But true say I had work on Saturday and my head was all over the place. I feel like I feel like it's the day after the night before now. Um it's myself and RJ's birthday actually on Tuesday, because we're born on the 14th, aren't we, Baba? Um so your girl's gonna be busy because as much as I was turning up, um I need to turn up on sorting out my man. So uh I think I'm gonna have to try and squeeze that in today because I was like, no, I can do it tomorrow. And then I'm like, no, you're recording two episodes of Pillow Talk tomorrow. You've got a meeting with your management. Where? Where is this? Where? So I might have to skid -do -do -do, um, to the, I don't even wanna spell it because he's getting really good at spelling, to the place where presents lie. That's where I might need to go today. Um, but anyway, let's get on with the super califragilistic stuff. Oh, just helped yes. Bode and RJ shoot some content. Content. And now RJ wants his payment. <laughs> RJ said, I don't work for free. RJ said, I do not work for free. Right, RJ? Right, so let me explain something to you, kid. Let me explain something to you, kid. I'm going to open this up. You're not having all of it. No. That is a very big chocolate. Exactly, so you understand you're just going to have a little bit. Yeah? Cool? High five. Deal? <laughs> <laughs> Mate, you can take your eyes off the chocolate. Right? <laughs> Break focus. It just keeps watching. <laughs> Don't Remember, take your eyes off the prize. Well, can I have a bowl then? Can you get a plastic bowl? No, no, no. It should be in the office. You left it in the office, kiddo. Stop running. Smith's Toys Superstores. At this point, Smith's, you should actually just sponsor me because I feel like I'm living in here. I've been in here five minutes and I'm already ready to give up. Who knew that there were like different sectors of Paw Patrol now, like a water version, a sea version. I can't find half the stuff the boy's got on his list, so I'm gonna have to just flex and dip as I always do. Massive gift bag so I've just got a huge gift bag I've got like five toys in there bish bash bosh real good nosh is it Monday? yes okay I remember that it's Monday Monday was it yesterday? Okay. Sunday what's the what's the day tomorrow? my birthday Oi, oi, Savaloi. you man already know what it is no need to intro we get on the treadmill <laughs> But for those of you that are new, I get on my treadmill every single day. It's a task I set myself at the back end of 2022. I felt really sick, so I had to pick up in 2023. Wouldn't call it a New Year's resolution, maybe a new life resolution. I really struggle with discipline. I can be a terribly lazy person. And getting on this every day is teaching me things about myself that I need to know and need to understand in order to flourish. Gosh, I sound like a telemarketer. Anyway, guys, you know what we need to do. Let's do the thing. Now then, so the 
whatever you made last time where you were like, oh, oh, oh. you were all day off, bro. I've had three coffees today. Why? I've actually given the last one I just had now was a double espresso. Why would you do that? Brixton, do you know how many people are reporting me to RSPCA because of how yeah, you were squished up? The last time up? you were shut up in the corner. And I didn't put you there. And everyone's like, Candice, you're killing him. You're killing him. I'm like, bruh, bruh. No, it just wants to be That's sat. where he found himself. He just wants to be sat next to him. <laughs> he just wants to be sat next to Candice. <laughs> You've been betrayed. I want to rock with you all night. I just, I just love the, I just love the like workflow. Like anything I do on my phone, shows up on here so I can just easily... I might go snappy snaps today, actually. What? What's Last of Us? <laughs> Zombie Last of Us. <laughs> You're Where was typing? You see, there is a period. There's a certain time, right? Come what may. You see, that time when the period is just ended? I need to get in. I need to get ready. Like, do my stretches because she's going to want it. She is going to want it. She's going to be like, ah. Anyhow, I try to say, I'm tired. She's like, tired wet. <laughs> Fling me, pump me, head top now. <laughs> Yo! So I know. So I'm <laughs> always prepared. <laughs> 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 I'm always prepared. Guys, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. But that is exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's about knowing these things. And it's, <laughs> and it's about knowing the kind of sexual partner that you are. Right. Also, guys, do you like my dress? It's by a brand called um, Hill, House. Hill House. Hill, and I met the founder when I was in New York because I know one of their major investors. Don't be jealous. No, I'm joking. No, no, actually, be jealous. Um, <laughs> and it gives Little House on the Prairie vibes. What are you doing? I'm just showing them my thing. Okay. Oh, what are you taking a picture of me? Thanks. No. why I'm trying to edit vlog number five for you which by the time you see this vlog that I'm on right now you would have watched number five um I've got a meeting where's my diary did you guys did you guys leave before the council came to shut us down yes but I'm not surprised because when my guy came down we were like wait is that literally so like, but I honestly, I was like, I don't think this. I, I don't think people stand out. Like, you know, you know, what, you can tell, like, oh, this, 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 um, the things that we need, like, all of it can have, like, a little zhuzh, but the reason why I also wanted you and Hilian is we had a conversation about, and I thought, we thought that you did the workout pose, but yeah. we had a conversation about, can these make... Um, yeah. um, so that child is not, that guy's going to be a child first, and, um, not being funny. Um, you need to put, really protect your child's interest. It's a little gift from Johnny Walker. Celebrate Mother's Day. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, flowers. Black label. I don't have none of that on the bar, you know. Man. And Joe Malone candle. Yes. Sweet up myself tonight. Treat up myself. Is that a candle? What is that? I think it's a candle. Happy birthday. You can see it when we get done set. <laughs> God. This boy is hilarious. You want me to sing now? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. 
Happy birthday to you. Mm. Oh, it's our birthday, RJ. Happy birthday, guys. <laughs> Happy birthday, guys. <laughs> Alright, sit down. Let's put them on quickly. Because I don't want you to be late for school. I'm sure you want to see your friends this morning. <laughs> I'm going to tell them that I'm five. Where are they? Should we go on the hunt? Let's look at here. No? No. Okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. Why is it stuck? No, it's not. You can pick it up now. Oh. <gasps> uh, uh. What's up? The best thing ever. Is this the best thing ever? Just what I didn't ask for, but <laughs> I do want it now. <laughs> Look. Did you need help with that? Yeah. Is it? <laughs> oh, I've seen this before. Have you seen it before? I've seen this kind of soup. I've seen this kind of soup on show before. Look. You have? Yeah. Do you like your presents? Yeah. Now I'm just have a quick test run. I can a test play. run, baby. We need to test I run can, to school. I can play with them over the floor. Yeah, but we need to get you to school. And I'll only open one to test run. We can't open the big one this morning because we've got school. Oh, I love myself! Auntie Emma got you that. This is massive. We'll build that after school. Oh, wow. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. I know you guys are like, girl, the whole of vlog five was about your birthday. Today's my actual birthday, guys. But because I share it with my son, you gotta, you gotta carve out some time for yourself. Um, we are about to jump on Petra because guess what? Petra don't give a damn that it's my birthday. Petra's like, the best present you could give yourself, sweetheart, is a dose of discipline. So I'm about to jump on Petra. Then I'm gonna do something a little bit different, something I haven't done in a while, but I used to really enjoy. I'm gonna treat myself. Today I'm looking for 10 minutes of endurance, so 10 minutes non-stop, at a faster pace than I completed my 20 minute goal at. You see what I'm trying to do? We need to combine speedier efforts for longer amounts of time so that when we get down to it we can get a pace that I desire over a long period of time that's what we need to do so you already know no long thing for the intro we need to do what we need to do the thing back in that back in that bag again whoa, whoa yeah yeah Back in there, yeah. Tell them to watch it. Nah, I ain't talking my pockets. Just know we ain't running out the way that we stock it. If I got it, you got it. If I call it, she slide and tell her to mop it. Yeah, I got that shit doing. Damn, she took that thing off and bring it around. Going at it till I'm on. Put that nani in a hole, I'm beating it down. I'm back in that bag again. Oh, 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 say less. I'm back in that bag again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, say less. I'm back in that. Yeah, what you doing? Yeah, yeah. Girl, let me get my, let me get my hair out of my face. Don't be jealous, don't be jealous. Peruvian, Peruvian, no, I'm checking. <laughs> um, I use Petra so much, I bet you guys didn't know, don't watch the mess of in here, that I have this. This was my first piece of Peloton equipment. Um, trained very hard with her, but I find cycling fun and I find it easy. Um, and so I've been dedicating the last almost three months purely to running, but today, Today, we gon' we gon' meet again. Boy, I'm working a double like I'm in an office. Tell them to watch it. Nah, I ain't talking my pockets. Just know we ain't running out the way that we stock it. If I got it, you got it. If I call it, she slide and tell her to mop it. Yeah, I got that shit doing. Damn, she took that thing off and bring it around. Going at it till I'm on. Put that nani in a hole. I'm beating it down. I'm back in that bag again. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, say less. I'm back in that bag again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, say less. I'm back in that. Yeah. What you doing? Yeah, yeah. I'm back in that. Hey. 
where you gone? And you should know that we on this forever You don't know me well, just ask again And you should know that I'm with all the fuckery Why you sit down and just watch the film? And you should know that Khan got a bottle of Don Feeling like Julio, pass it in Mind on some M's, going in Back in that bag where I'm going again I'm dunking on them, just load a rim Free my niggas, that's all I'm sweating Thank you, honey Boxes? journal on your gravestone remember auntie candice did say it did it cold play are the best pop group to have ever existed i, I, I don't want to hear it beat i don't want to hear it destiny stop. i don't want to hear it cold play are the best pop group to have when i say banger after banger after banger after banger and you know chris martin's a pisces so he's really he's hitting us with them emotional vibrations making us cry but hailing us up at the same time you see God? <clears throat> listen it has been a morning of cold play i'm just beating my face i don't have anything in particular to do today i think we're gonna go out for dinner tonight i'm gonna make but they take us out for dinner tonight um and you know i like to do these little talky talk check-ins on the vlog let me tell you something let me tell you what i want to talk about today i want to talk about the fact that i woke up this morning and i really had to hold back tears you know because i've woken up beyond the woman i expected to be at 35 and let me tell you something i really didn't start to see this woman come into formation until my 30th birthday and that's the day I had RJ I didn't really start to make headway or feel like I was making headway on the woman that I've woken up this morning feeling like I am knowing that I am living in that reality but looking back now and it, it only works retrospectively every single second and element and thing and what we think is a mistake and what we think is a wrong turn was needed to create this and i just woke up so grateful i actually can't I, like the gratitude this morning is off the charts to wake up in good health and sound mind and in a warm home with loving healthy children and a loving healthy man and a loving healthy dog don't annoy me <laughs> don't annoy me that's 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 a big gift in itself because like I said, I am constantly surrounded. Hell, I've lived a life where those things were just not, you know. I've been down. I've dealt with I've dealt with grief. I've dealt with all the stuff. And to wake up this morning and not be dealing with that stuff, hallelujah. Listen. Positive high vibrations. And I mean it, I'm not in the low vibrational settings. Them days are done, like drop me out drop me out and this isn't to say you guys have seen me have low moods on this vlog this isn't to say because i do believe in the idea of toxic positivity it can't all be rainbows we're humans we're going to have a range of emotions but the 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 chapter like the, the, the chapter title high vibration high vibration high vibration listen huh. i am so excited 
for the next 10 years when i say like i just i'm just giddy every day waking up like oh my oh my god oh my god car wow the party's really getting started so to those of you who watch my vlogs because i know there's people a lot younger than me so like early 20s mid 20s to those of you who watch my vlogs and someone left a comment or they 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 left i saw a comment somewhere that said no someone posted on their instagram and they were like you know following candice as a content creator in her mid 30s gives me hope for what's possible after a messy mid 20s or you know i know a lot of you watch content where it's it can be so you know on one hand it's the constant bottle popping and the luxury and the flying out and the da -da 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 -da, and that might not be your reality and all these other things and i hope you get a range of things from the content that i share but yeah you know stay locked car i'm really about to show you guys that you see this mid 30s 40s thing it is the shit bruv it's the, you couldn't pay me to go back to 25 not interested declined card declined can't can't meet you there so you couldn't pay me bro I am so self-assured, so self-confident, so in tune with my intuition, so much wiser. And this isn't to say don't enjoy those times, but I I found them torturous, to be fair. I, I really did. I really did. Just know that the woman you see on your screen right now is very aware of herself and what she wants and what her desires are and is very in tune with how she's going to acquire the best life for her anyway this don't need to be a seven minute ramble let's get on with the day when i say guys i'm really what in the genetically modified strawberry is going on there um is she gonna eat it yeah it's frozen as well i need to check the settings on my freezer you know on my fridge um i'm really trying to get back on this healthy eating thing uh had a very delicious light dinner last night um you see all these carbs and sugar it's just not good man <laughs> i don't know what else to say and like the older you get the more you realize that there are foods that my body just struggles to process and i'm not in the games so i know i said a few days ago this is the last day of me doing silliness rj's birthday cake is coming and Kirsty makes the wickedest cake so i shan't deny myself we are going out for dinner tonight and i am gonna have a steak so it, it gonna do what it do but in the interim we can refocus on the dog wants to come in so i know because i still need to get your bag so come on baba you mean bag oh, yeah plural you're right you're right there yeah oh do you love it yeah that's so cool Red looks like a spider and he's not a spider <laughs> rj that's so cool that's why he's upside down yeah Do you want to look at your cake properly? Cake Lego. Is it cake Lego? Look, look at that. Wow. You wanted Lego Spider-Man, right? Oh. Yeah. 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 I mean, I could turn it, but then the people them are just gonna see what I saw the first time I saw you, and you were leading me up the stairs. It's a bit bigger now, to be fair. <laughs> I just want a rough neck from the jump. What am I looking at? Aww. Aww. No, come on. It's a bird! It's a shark! I'm dying. I'm dying. It's a bag. <laughs> Boom. That's a shoe! That's a shoe. Boom. Oh my gosh! Big, big 35. No, that is hard, bruv. Now, what bag is that? Oh my god, that's my Rosantica bag! That's my Rosa. That's the bag I wore on our wedding! You <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, he does it again. He does it again. He does it again. Brown Brown that was hard. That was Man's a bad man, you know. <laughs> No, that is nuts. Yeah, boy. You're actually insane. Okay, let me put on a dress so we can get a picture. One second. You're insane. 
<laughs> so we're out for our birthday dinner, aren't we, Argy? Yeah. Are we having birthday dinner? And it's my birthday. So this, this is how it's like. This and my mum's birthday. This is how it's like. Birthday, like this. You melt. You nearly melted all the ice. I didn't. Now let's see how it tastes with lots of those bubbles. Uh, RJ, why are you not gonna pay? Money. I uh, didn't bring. You didn't bring your money. I forgot to bring it. So who's gonna pay for dinner? <laughs> you are. <laughs> he went. He went like this to you, and I was like. And then he said, "You are." <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna do what? Pay because I didn't bring my money. <laughs> you say that all the time. You need to start bringing your money. When I bring my money, I'm gonna pay. That I'll try to. That, that's, like, that's, I might be a bit shy. Well, that's, oh, that's what you said. Not a super busy day. Lots of content to shoot. Um, sponsored content. Then we have a dinner is being put on by The Ordinary and the CEO of The Ordinary is going to be there. If you don't know Ordinary Skincare, get to know. I literally have Ordinary Moisturiser on my hands because I found, especially for his face, their moisturiser is the only thing that doesn't break RJ's face out. His face specifically is very, very sensitive. And so, um, yeah, we're going to do that tonight. <laughs> out of asking these, these yes. questions yeah. these deep questions yeah but somehow they stayed with me and after doing you know, lots of different things it's... i'm not even going to spoil that one i'm not going to spoil that one body and i need to watch that together i'm not spoiling that there we go how about i end that there i've not really vlogged today guys um you know what we that's how it's gonna go one week, we're going to be having a massive party. The next week, we ain't going to be doing shit. The next week, we're going to be in Paris. The week after that... <laughs> Your uncle is starting. Although he has told me off and told me not to call him uncle. Because apparently now some of you guys are calling him uncle. And he doesn't want to face his real age. Now I need to cook, cook yeah, the I'm kids saying, dinner before I zoom out of here. I know, I say I'm always going to insert o OTD and then I never do it. Today I should proper do it because I'm kind of in a hurry. But we are wearing an oh, I think my I think this is dirty, guys. Bear with me. Hopefully that's better. Yeah, oh my gosh. You guys have been getting booky footage all day. Sorry. Um, essential Antwerp dress, which used to be a little too tight. But Petra's Petra ring, as we can see. Um... I know you guys are going to say you're tired of these shoes. And like I said in OOTD, if you're willing to send me money for new shoes, then you won't be tired. But I feel like there aren't many of you that are going to do that. Quick Chanel stud. Today, I'm going in with the Palmer Violet Chanel. I, I, I don't wear her a lot. I think I'm just scared, staining, you know, but she is my favourite gun. I don't know if we'll ever see that. Even if we did see that colour again, look me in my eye as I tell you. It won't be me that's buying it at these inflated prices, okay? That was the last they're seeing of me for a bit. 
It's all right, isn't it? It's not the dress you chose, but it's close enough. Yeah. And he loves these shoes. Not that I let uncle dictate. <laughs> not that I let body dictate what I wear. But he has an affinity for certain things. Um, so, yeah. He's going to be like, you Say it. Say you. Oh, my God. is today's look please i'm back in this black cos dress you know i love me a black cos dress i just think it's a staple everyone should have i actually wear mine back to front see the labels there um because because i'm so little i love where i can i like to open up a neckline and of course the zips at the back so we just bust this back to front play with your clothes but anyway look how strong this look is please i just i should I even put a mug? The thing with my gold tooth cap is I have to keep popping it out to eat certain things and I don't think I can be bothered with that today, but with my gold window, <laughs> no, sorry. This look is too spicy. With my hourglass coat, no, I'm actually obsessed. Obsessed with this look today. Hello? Yeah, I'm just, I've just left the podcast recording. Guys, I feel so bad. I barely picked up my camera today, so I couldn't record in the podcast recording. Then I met my manager for lunch at one of the Soho houses, couldn't record in there. I'm currently in a room at a building. I'm about to do a talk with for an interview for the Royal College of Midwives. Now, if you follow my work, you would know my first book, I Am Not Your Baby Mother, made huge waves and impact when it came to the maternal... Um, care of especially black women in the UK. This is a talk that was meant to happen last October, but I got what we all agreed is COVID. The test kept coming up negative, but I've, I've not been that sick in years. And so I couldn't make it. I wanted to do the, they asked me to do the talk for Black History Month. They were so gracious, cause you know, last minute getting sick. And so now I'm doing it today. And so I'm so excited. And I'm gonna be speaking to a room of black midwives. And those who know, know. If you know the story, you know the story. But I'm not here to give no one but God the glory. <laughs> okay. Um, it's been a hell of a week for midwives. And my name keeps getting dragged up. Because of one piece of something that I've got no interest in. But I think it's going to be interesting to speak about that situation. In a space where my voice can be impactful. And not just used for gossip. So, let's do it. So random, guys. But I've never seen this before. Free tampons. Well, actually, no. In certain members clubs. But... This is this should be everywhere, like bum period poverty. Just free up the tampons and stop being an idiot. Love this. Like me working with a brand or whatever, only employing me because you think I speak to the masses is not enough. You have to take my blackness with it. So if me having a wild yardy party and rocking up to Soka is offensive <laughs> to your PR team, then we're not the best match mm -hmm. because that is part and parcel of who I am. But it took years for those layers to come off. And all I would hope now is that women and girls trying to do what I do, they have an easier time or they, you know, it's quicker for them to be themselves. It becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy, strong black woman. Mm -hmm. Not me, sir. Everything <laughs> broke down, man. I'll just lie on the floor and cry. 
that I wasn't going to explicitly talk about race anymore mm -hmm. because that's something for them. Mm -hmm. This is my lived experience. Mm -hmm. That's never going to change. So you will get that in drips and drabs. Mm -hmm. But I also thought that doing that with the kind of platform I had made white people believe that that's all we face. Mm -hmm. We face joy. Mm -hmm. We face happiness. We face good times. Mm -hmm. It's not every time I'm going to get on this internet crying. Mm -hmm. Your comments, please. Uh, and I'm not changing. Too close to me. I know. I know. I know. Oh, there you are. Yay. You like jumpers with hoods, don't you? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Should we brush your teeth? You guys know what time it is. Time to eat the frog. I am outside. I said I wanted to incorporate more outside workouts. I'm away all next week and the beautiful hotel that I'm staying in, hey, the gym is closed. So I better get used to being outside because just because there's no treadmill doesn't mean we're not going to do the thing. So I've decided to get outside today. We're going in for a 30 minute walk plus run, 15 minutes of straight running time. Let's do the thing. pretty good hit every single segment gave it my all i'm totally encapsulated by the runners high right now so i did it We are shooting, it's a working day, it's a Friday. Got money to make, it's a Friday. Got money to <laughs> Um, My husband recently learned to become a bad man photographer. So if I flip the camera to him, you'll see he has the camera on me and we are shooting a campaign for... Woo! Is it banging? Damn! Let me see. Oh, Damn! Period! Period! Pure. Hey, babe! Oh, my hips. You guys say I've got good knees. It's my hips that need work. I'm wearing this stunning green ball gown, which I don't pull I don't out need as to touch much that as I should. All. You don't need to touch that at all. <laughs> I swear to God. Um, but he says he's got the shot, so work could be done. Yeah, I've got the shot. Close the camera, please, please. Closer. Purr. Periodic table. And the gold shoes actually just look good. Okay. I know. Yeah, shoes. Good. Right. <laughs> oh, the one they use in the movies. And it's like, hoo, 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 hoo. you know, you watch so many movies, you know what I'm talking about. Okay. Your uncle's annoying. And just for that, I'm going to say uncle because he hates the fact that I'm calling him uncle. <laughs> you know what uncle is? So annoying. <laughs> And um, we've got a date tonight. I don't think he remembers. With Last of Us? Yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> he remembered. <laughs> You're annoying. Guys, this room's a state as ever. Hey, I'm back home. I had to get little man from school today because Esme, Esme had sports like every day this week. <laughs> RJ made me this gorgeous cookie. Thank you, love from Richard. Obsessed. Loxatan um, sent me a gift box. You see this shower oil? When I had no money, this was the thing that I would buy every six weeks without fail. It just, it just gives a luxury feeling for not bare money, and I've I've been obsessed with it ever since. I've been using Arvin shower oil for years. So they sent me all these goodies, and then. 
Lancome sent me this. Not really sure. It's a peptide cream. Um, cute, 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 cute. For tonight, Bode and I have a date. We're going to watch the last two episodes of Last of Us. Um, and it's Friday. And tomorrow we all have to get up early because we're going to the to Longleat Safari Park, which I'm actually really excited about because so many people say it's amazing. So my hopes are high. Let's Why do days where you feel like you've got all the time in the world and then you don't? Um, it's Safari Day taking RJ to Longleat Safari Park. Drinking from his cup again. Um, for his birthday. Mm. There's nothing like that morning coffee. No coffee after that hits that way. Um, what do I want to talk about today, girls? What do I want to talk about today? Um, the usual. Let's talk about having a positive mental attitude. No, I'm, I was going to say I'm joking, but I'm not. Um, yeah, like one of the biggest requests or questions I get is like, you know, if you followed my entire journey, which so many of you won't, but I'm not even going to give you a quick debrief, it doesn't matter. But everyone's like, how did you turn your life around? Like, how did you guys go from living the way you were living to living the way you are now? Candice, you used to be like such a Debbie Downer. I did. How did you become so positive? And I thought, you know, it. yes, yes. Um, I, it's not that. I, it's not that it's saccharine or I'm being fickle. It is manifestation. The reason why I'm a bit hesitant to have that conversation is because manifestation has taken more blows than than the entire wellness theme on a whole. Like, manifestation has become very, very whitewashed. Listen, I'm just going to talk the thing. This is my channel. It's become very, very whitewashed. And we are now being sold manifestation by pretty thin white women. And let me tell you something for free because I did say this in my book, Sister Sister. There are no easier manifestors than pretty thin white women. Candice, why is that? Because at the root of manifestation is energy. And what the universe, what that energy desires the most is that you innately believe that you are worthy of what you are asking for. Now, let, riddle me this. If you are born into a body that society has always said is number one, is the winner, should have everything, is manifestation not going to be easier for you? Because from in the womb, you are gearing up to be like, no, I'm a G. I got this. Like, this is my world. And that is the root of manifestation. And that is why so many people of colour hate the term BAME, black women struggle with manifestation because we are really having to learn that attitude, that internal dialogue, I'm worthy, this is my world, anything I desire, I can acquire. We're having to learn that very late on in life. So pretty thin white women are decades, centuries, millennia ahead of us in that regard. The beauty is, is that once you learn the tools, once you learn to vibrate on that level, you can never unlearn it. Like, when when I'm not feeling 100% myself, an alarm goes off in my brain that is like, girl, report, 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 retreat, retreat. My brain is like, you know that, you know that is not the vibration that gets you what you want. You know that is not the vibration that takes you where you want to go. So the good thing is, once you know it, and once you practice it consistently, you can never backslide. There's gonna that your subconscious is always gonna be like, you're fucking up. You're like, don't you worry about that. But I just want to see the discussion of manifestation from people who haven't always had the ability to have the palm of the world, have the world in the palm of their hands. Sorry. That's that's where I'm coming from with that. And that's why I enjoy talking about it so much. But and child, because that is also a massive request. Everyone's like, when are you going to write a book about manifestation? If y'all don't, if y'all don't let me breathe. <laughs> Can you not see the pressure is getting worse? Though? Um, but yeah, I just, you know, I always like to talk about that. I have no idea where this conversation is going, but I'll insert it anyway. Guys, I'm running so late. Body's about to shout at me. But quickly, I'm wearing this Hugo Boss printed dress that I got from them. I mean...
This is insane. Is this, we're going. Is this not, I can't, I can't. Also, I'll defo insert some other footage because this footage is terrible. But get into these Christian Dior. I call them my space raiders. God, I'm sweating, we need to go. What? I just let mum drive it. <laughs> say that again, RJ, say that again. You need to just let mum drive it. Why should mum be driving the car, RJ? Because that's, because that goes too far. Oh, child. From the mouth of and babes. Risk, and risk it. And, and he and risks it. Ah! Too much. <laughs> too much. And it's not funny. It's not. And I just feel like this chair is not hugging me. Anyway, we're on our way. It's a long drive. I've man. not done this kind of drive in years. It's <laughs> back when I was in the... When I was working in corporate world, I used to do drives like this, 127 miles. I'm trying to test myself now to see if I can do that non-stop. I'm gonna if try and still, drive home, guys. If I can still do that non-stop. That will be the longest drive I've ever done. The longest on record that I've ever done is 170 miles non-stop. Oh, non-stop. Yeah, but, um, Chocolate but and I'm, I'm, not sure my, I'm not sure my body can take that anymore, but we'll see. You need to get out and stretch and use the toilet and la 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 la. Hell yeah, well back in the day, man, I'll do that in my sleep. I used to do Croydon to Manchester non-stop. Yeah, he used to do Croydon to Manchester, guys. Non-stop. Anyway, we're, we're going to Manchester soon. I'm not even gonna tell you guys why, but let me tell you, the universe is actually just in alignment. I'm so excited, isn't it, buddy? Why are you smiling, man? No, 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 bye, bye. So many rocks. Can you zoom, you zoom I've never seen Stonehenge. Where are you going? I've seen a seven. Of course. Wait, are we on Stonehenge? Ah! Oh, are we driving on Stonehenge? Yeah, we're, we're driving past it. Walk with the lemurs. <laughs> I like to move it, move it. Do I do move move it, move it. it. Yeah, I do not get out of your car. Do not get out. Sound horn for help. Bongo pass. What's that? Oh. Bongo pass. Oh, they have seen some animals. Don't see anything. <gasps> yeah. I see animals over there. Oh, can you see RG? <coughs> what? Are you able to see ostriches? Maybe. Ostriches! Can you zoom in, mummy? Yes, I can zoom in, baby. <laughs> Let me then zoom out. Zoom in. I, I have been zooming in. Look, zebras! Zebras, now I They're can so see cool, them. man! Now I can see them better. Yeah, look! Oh, as he's saying, slow down, this basically. This is the worst time. Ooh, it's a whole family of ostriches. I'm Sorry, sure guys. ostriches are I don't know what my guy is doing. These are gazelles. Yeah. Gazelles? I'm not sure. They're too big for gazelles. Really? Yeah. I thought those were gazelles down there. What they're looking for. I know. They're like, what the heck? Are they looking up here? They're looking at us. They're looking at the cars. Yeah. Flamingos. Flamingos. Over there. Over there. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah. So what are these? Ew. 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 I just took a video of that one. Go to the toilet. That's his toilet though. Uh, Disgusting. Outside is their toilet. Disgusting. The ones that bring deliver babies. Pelicans, yeah. pelicans, pelicans. <coughs> no, it did say stalks on the thing. Stalks, it said stalks. The ones that deliver babies. Oh, whatever. I wish. 
and fly out. I know. Wow. It's a very frizzy hair. Wow. Love that you said that. Wow. You are about to enter the monkey jungle. Huh? Monkeys will climb on your vehicle and could cause damage. Bruh. No, I'm good. Stop. Look at the monkeys! Oh, okay. my okay. Oh, my okay. oh my god, guys! Stay calm. Stay calm. That's small though. I don't think they can do anything. They're on someone's car. Oh! Oh, Jay, look! Oh, Jay! Oh, Jay! Oh, Jay! Oh, Jay! Oh, Jay! It's in front of the camera. Look, like, look, 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 look. Ah, Where is it? It's in front of the camera. It's in front of the camera. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> look, look. Ah, Jesus Christ. <laughs> they love your car, Candy. Ah, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's on the wheel. It's fully on the wheel. Bruh. It's biting it. Ew. Don't scratch your butt. <laughs> Caught in 4K! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Look at him, look at him! We need to, to bring that car so that we can go far! Oh, another ostrich! Look, there he goes, there he goes, there he oh, goes! Oh, there he is! I hope he doesn't poo on the car! <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to pay some rent? <laughs> you better be careful it doesn't pull out your wiper, because it can. Very human-like. Yeah, very, very. Oh. What, what in God's, God's name? What are you doing? I'm going to do monkey monkey. All of them are cheeky. What are you doing? Oh my God, he's fully perched on my Mirror. Mirror. Bruh. You were right, Dad. Oh, we should have not. You should not. They are. Close it, Dad. Mungus. They're so big, I can't even zoom in. I have to zoom out. Those are cows. Those are cows. That's Those a cow. cow. With, with horns. <laughs> yeah. Cows have horns. A bull. That's it's a bull. Oh, hell no. A bull. A bull is a bull. Yeah. Yeah, but that's a cow. That's a male cow. A male really? Cow. Really? Yes. Oh, I don't know. Bro, that's cows in Nigeria have horns. I Steady. thought cows, I thought bulls were bulls. Yeah. The, the male cows. Are male cows. cows. A male one is a bull. Really? 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 Frank says me. Uh, Back me up. Google it. <laughs> what? A male cow is a bull? But that's a cow with a horn. Yeah, why? Because cows have horns. No, they don't. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Oh, my God. This guy's a mumu behind it. I've seen a bag of cow <laughs> with horns. No, never. Google it. Cows don't have horns. So what is that? That's a bull. Female cow. Fem adult females are referred to as cows. Yeah. And adult males are referred to as bulls. <laughs> really? How, yes. How dare you shout at us, Dad? How dare you oh, shout at us? I know what I'm saying. A bull. I never knew that. Because you so, guys are a lodo. <laughs> so a bull is a cow. I feel like that's stupid. A oh, lodo. <laughs> So you guys are making me feel like I was going crazy. <laughs> I was like, ah, ah, I, it's the male is a bull. And the I female thought is a cow. bull was a bull I and a cow know. was a cow. No, the male is bull. Oh, you learn something new every day. Oh, damn. <laughs> Sheesh. <laughs> We're not done. Look, I've never seen Tell a joke about the camel crossing the road, guys. Someone make up a joke about the camel crossing the road. Uh -huh. I, can't, me. I can't think of anything. Me, me, me. Huh? The camel was crossing the huh? road, and if a car drives <laughs> over it, it will get spots. You fully stood there and did not go. Literally crossing the road. Now the car can't move. It's coming. 
Come on. What if he didn't move? What would we do? Bro, you're stuck here. Look at all of the hay around there, Mom. Dis like you ain't got no food. Yeah, are you not? Dis like you ain't got no food. We've it. got some. It. We've got some snacks, but I'm not giving him any. Guys, he fully said he's finished with this place. Finished like this. we didn't drive almost two and a half hours just for him. Lord. Yeah, he asked for it, you know. Man, he says he's finished with this place. You want to go home now? Joke. <laughs> it was a joke. You better Good. be a joke. Seriously. You, you better be a joke, or else I'll make you drive. Hello? 